Hello everyone. I've got a little birthday surprise in the mail today. It is the Pine 64 single board computer that I ordered back in March. I um, participated in a Kickstarter uh, program and I'm um, actually surprised that it's here this soon as they had uh, quite quite a um, enthusiastic crowd uh, for this particular project. I believe they sold around 36,000 units. Um, so I'm just kind of happy that mine is here. Uh, let's uh, take a look inside the box here. Now my package will be a little bit different than most of the packages that you may have seen because I ordered everything. I ordered the the $15 board along with all the possible accessories offered on the Kickstarter project. So let's see what's in the bag. Lots of little parts and notes. Okay, we have a few little um, <laughs> tiny little notes here. See the on-off button here, the additional RAM that I ordered. I believe that would be the Wi-Fi antenna. Inside this box is the actual Pine 64 unit. Now this is an entire computer on a single board. I'm just going to leave that in the static wrap for now. Um, and in this box, you see there's going to be some assembly required. There is the 7 inch touch screen. which most of the uh, folks did not order. But like I said, I went all out. Very nice little um, touch screen. I'm sure I'll be making a little case for that. And here is the power supply. Okay, and quickly looking over all of the parts here. I see that I may need some instructions on how to assemble this. So I will have to take a little moment and go to their website and figure that all out. Um, like I said, I don't have a keyboard or a mouse. I actually have them. I don't have I didn't purchase them with this. Um, but I believe with that um, I will be able to have a completely working computer. Um, considering I bought a VIC-20 back in 1982 uh, and then followed by a IBM XT which cost about five thousand dollars at that time. Uh, this is an amazing uh, product, an entire computer on one board. So I can't wait to delve into this and I will um, see what the, the assembly uh, will require and I'll get back with you. Thanks.